Hey everyone, it's MLB Crystal Diamond here, and welcome back to a new video. Where I live right now, it's about 9.30 a.m. I'm tired. Eh, not really that tired, but still. Also, if you hear, like, purring or just cat noises, it's because my cat's in my room. Today's video is going to be a toy run. No, I'm doing this video. I haven't made a video in over, like, seven months. I think. I haven't checked. Based on memory. Well, I'm awake now. And you didn't have to do that. You could have just asked me, or even told me, instead of pushing me off the edge of the filming area. Why? Well, that wouldn't make it fun now, would it? So basically, you're taking over this video. Didn't I make that obvious enough? Do I need to push you off the edge again? No, no, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm good. Well, wake me when you're done. Hello everyone watching out there, it's Plumette here. I know you all missed me. Although I haven't actually seen any comments saying, where is Plumette Reviews? Cry. For this toy review, I'm going to be reviewing the My Little Pony the Movie Twilight Sparkle and Songbird Serenade Festival Friends set. Yeah! So down here we have a little picture of Songbird Serenade. Then up here is the My Little Pony the Movie logo. Then up here we have some really pretty box art of all the main six, Tempest Shadow, some sea ponies. Then up here we have some warnings and all that. So turning the box on the side, we can see some really pretty art of Songbird Serenade and Princess Twilight. And then on the back, it has some more pretty art of Twilight and Songbird. Then up here it has their names again, it says they're the superstars of friendship. So I think that's everything for the box, so I think now it's time to open up the toy. Here are the toys out of the box, so we're going to review the accessories first, then the two pony figures. So first we have this really cute blue mirror. Then we have these two really cute skirts that you can actually put on your ponies, so it's cool. Then we have Songbird Serenade's little black um, jacket thing. Yeah, I, I, yeah. And then we have our little bow, which it's really cute. Which It's really good to keep it on her because her hair gets a bit messy if you don't keep it on her and it goes everywhere, so yeah, it's good. And her microphone, which is really cute. It looks like a flower. Wait, is it a flower? No, it's a microphone. I knew that. So moving on to the pony figures, I'm going to show Princess Twilight first, and Songbird, and yeah. So looking at Princess Twilight, she has a bit of a messy mane and tail, but that could be easily fixed. She's in like a royal type of position, she has her mouth open, and I'm noticing when I first opened her that she has like some dirt on her nose, and I don't know if it'll come off or not, but it doesn't really matter. Her wings are really cool, they look really pretty. Cutie mark, and that's really everything that I have to say about Twilight. So moving on to Songbird Serenade, she has rarity eyes, and they're really big, so that's pretty cool. She has a really pretty cutie mark, she has a really pretty colour scheme, and I really like how Hasbro actually made her hair like this instead of long like Twilight's and like they make basically every other ponies, so it's pretty cool, you know, it's something different. So here is Songbird in her full complete outfit. Now I was gonna show Twilight in one of the skirts, but I tried to put the purple one on her and it didn't seem to work out properly, so... So I think that's everything for this review, I hope you all enjoyed it. And I hope you're all happy that I'm reviewing again, and it's not just Crystal Diamond. Thank you all so much for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Bye, everypony!